How to change Windows 10 default password policy. Click on Windows logo. Scroll down and find Windows Administrative Tools. Expand Windows Administrative Tools. Scroll down. Click on Local Security Policy. This is our Local Security Policy console opened. Expand Account Policy. Click on Password Policy. This is our Windows 10 default password policy. As you can see, the default password length is zero. Means we can create any user without password. Which is not good for our organization. Double click on minimum password length. I am doing 7 in the option of minimum password length here. So that if we create any new user, then his password should be at least 7 characters. Click on apply. Click on OK. The option of password must meet complexity requirement means that you want a password that is made up of numeric, symbolic, alphabets. Double click password must meet complexity requirement. I am enabling the option of password must meet complexity requirement. This is great for our Windows security. Click on apply. Click on OK. The option of minimum password age means that after how many days the user can change or renew his password. The default is currently zero. I am doing it 30. So that the user can renew their password after every 30 days. Click on apply. Click on OK. As you can see, the default in the maximum password age option is 42 days. I let this be the default. Close local security group console. Go to run and type GP update. Press enter. The changes that we have made in the password policy of Windows are being updated through the GP update command. Password policy is updated. Now we create a new user and see. Go to run. Type compmgmt.msc. Press enter. Open computer management console. Expand local user and group. Click on user. All our default users except admin. Right click and select new user. Fill username. Example Rohit. Fill full name and description. In my case I am leaving blank. I am now keeping password 123. Uncheck the user must change password at next logon. Check on user cannot change password and password never expires. Click on create. User is not created as you see. Because our password length is 3. Which did not match our password policy. Click on OK. Now I am keeping my password 1234567. Click on create. User is not created as you see. Because our password is length 7. Which matches our password policy. But we enabled the complex password option. Therefore our user is not created. Click on OK. Now I am keeping my password 123 at ASD. Click on create. Our user has been created. The password we kept. 123 at ASD it matches our Windows password policy perfectly. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for latest updates.